started back in 1901 when the Rutland Railroad opened the Island Line. And when the railroad went out of business in 1962, a number of visionary people looked at ways we could transform the, tra the rail into a spectacular trail. And then, unfortunately, while many sections were sold off, a number of advocates came out to redevelop the Burlington Bike Path, the Colchester Causeway, and then the Allen Point Access Area in South Huron. We were so close to uniting all those sections into a united 14-mile trail until April of 2011. And that's when we had the big record Lake Champlain flood that eroded long sections of the island line. When the flood of April 2011 hit, the record flooding along Lake Champlain that eroded key sections of the trail, we were all disheartened. We worried that uh, this key trail had been damaged beyond repair. But through everybody's hard work and coming together, uh, the city of Burlington, the town of Colchester, uh, Vermont Fish and Wildlife in South Hero, we have come together to fix this resource. And it took everybody. There were bake sales. There were kids who uh, scraped up money among their friends. We had the bike shops donate a percent of sales last summer. Uh, they collectively raised over $15,000. We want to thank Run Vermont for contributing uh, extensively as well. This was a community project of people invested in fixing our trail. With your help and hundreds of others, together we have funded the Big Fix. And I am thankful and grateful for the community's investment to restore the flood damage from 2011 and take the next step forward to unite this trail with the bike ferry between Colchester and South Hero. Together, we have restored the Colchester Causeway. And together, the South Hero Causeway will soon be under reconstruction. This unite, united trail, 14 miles long, will be an asset for generations to enjoy. We could not have done it without you. Thank you very much.